urgent measure to uphold regulatory compliance by the parties. Our reporter, Marian Amaria Bangura, has more on this story. In a public notice dated 18th October 2023, the Political Party Regulations Commission has expressly sent a notice of intent to the register parties that have failed to comply with some of the provisions in the Political Parties Act. Chairman of the Commission, Abdullahi Bangwa, says none of the political party has so far complied with the post-election campaign expenses breakdown, which he said is to be done 60 days after the elections, according to the Act. It's just a question of compliance. I mean, the Act requires the political parties to be reporting to all certain aspects. They have a reporting obligation they should do to the Commission. And uh, one of them being uh, post-election campaign finance or campaign expenses reports. They need to tell us 60 days, as uh, I think it's section 26.2, uh, I mean, sorry, section 37.2 of the Political Parties Act requires them that uh, within 60 days after the announcement of the result of uh, an election they participated in, they are supposed to submit to us a uh, declaration of their assets and liabilities and to also tell us the campaign expenses they incurred during the campaign period. So those are the things we are demanding. And also there is the regular uh, annual report they are supposed to give us within the first three months of every year. I mean, even that one, there are certain political parties that have not done that. But, uh, after the election, I will need to check with my staff, but I cannot recall them bringing any, of, uh, any report to me from any of those political parties. But as I say, I need to confer with them. But no report, post-election report has reached my table. The chairman further said that the notice will run for 90 days and said after that time, if political parties do not comply with the provisions, they will be deregistered. And uh, the act also makes provision that uh, in the event you fail to submit those uh, reports by section 26.1, we can deregister you. And uh, 26.2 says that uh, before we deregister, we are supposed to give them 90 days notice so that uh, whatever default that uh, is subsisting, they will have the opportunity of regularizing that. In the event they fail to do so, then we can go on to the register. Chairman Abdullahi added that the move underscores the Commission's commitment to foster a transparent and accountable democratic process. However, further updates from the political parties on this notice will be aired in our subsequent programs. Marian Amaria Bangura, AYV News, Freetown.